has uh, something that kind of ties in to us visiting Granbury. What? Yeah, and that is five road trip essentials. We could have used this yesterday, mm-hmm. Mars. We could have. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, so, you don't know that absolutely. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, I do. I made the list. So, when you get ready to go on a road trip, I mean, there's lots of things you got to think about. You know, you want to make sure your car's ready, and you want to make sure you got all your safety gear and stuff. But there's a few other things you really got to have. And this first thing I wanted to point out was an organizer that fits behind the seat. Mm-hmm. Now, this one fits behind the driver's seat, and you got one for the passenger seat. And you can put the kids can put all kinds of things in these things. they got water bottles. they got places to put pencils, pins. You know, toys, whatever you want. To so it's kind of like their, a backpack for the car. Except yeah. it's right in front of them. Yeah. So they all they got to do is reach out of their car seat if they're in one and, and grab it. And so it would be great to keep all their That's stuff in one idea. place. But the second one is if you get if you break down on the side of the road, you know, used to you'd take flares. You know, for safety flares, uh-huh. you have to fire them up. Well, these are LED flares that you can charge through I've your USB. These. I've seen these. This is a pack of three. You can set them out, and they blink, and they flash, and, and it's really great for a warning thing, and they don't take up very much Only nineteen ninety five for a set of three. But wait, there's more. Yes, there is more. <laughs> there is more. There is a air compressor that's about the size of a paperback book. In fact, the one I have what? pictured here is the one I have, and I have it under the seat of the truck. Did you get it free? Nope. I wish. <laughs> Amazon, and, and it works really well, and it doesn't take up much room. It will air up the tires without any problem, uh, basketballs, anything else your kids need done. But the really good one that you really need more than anything else is this fourth item. Now, it is a jump box is the easiest way to describe it. It's small. It's a little, It's bigger than a paperback. The one I have is a little bit older than this one, but it's the same brand. And you connect it to your battery just like you do a jump cable, except you can push a button. And after you've charged it up with USB power, it will jump start your car. Hmm. Now, it will also have, this particular one also has some USB ports. If your phone, if you're broke down, your phone's going dead, you can plug it in and charge your phone. Um, and uh, you can plug in flashlights, anything that runs off a USB port. Well, I would imagine that you probably jump start a human heart with that, couldn't you, if you did it the right well, way? Well, if you clip those the cables paddles. on the right place, you uh-huh, could. Uh-huh, right sure. on your nipples, right oh, on there. That's what I was thinking. Uh-huh. All right. And, uh, whew, David. This is a little more expensive. This will cost you over 100 bucks to get one of these that will actually jump start your car. But, again, it does a lot of things if you're broke down on the side of the road to uh, keep you safe and going. This last item is really super important, but it's really the easiest. Duct tape. You quack, need quack, quack. a roll of duct tape. Now, you can get it in a roll like we have here. And it comes in colors. And it comes in colors. And the, uh, the next picture is a picture of some flat. If you don't want to have a roll, you can get some flat. They do make some. It's not near as much of it. If so you kind of Flat? Yeah, it's kind flat of folded tape. flat. Yeah. Doesn't take up as much room as a roll. But then if you're not sure what you would do with duct tape in your car, if you broke down, if you go to the next one, Jeff, please, mm-hmm. you can tape up hoses. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You can tape up hoses. You have a water hose go out. You can tape it up. It's AC pressure. Put some water in there. It'll hold pressure for a little bit. And then the next one, if you injure yourself and you need to create a brace, here again, the duct tape will create an arm brace where you can hold your arm tight up against you like you're supposed to. And pull all the hair off your arm later. Yeah, yeah, And your chest. Yeah, yeah. Well, except for you. And then the next one, if you have a cut or something like that and you need to cover it up, you can duct tape it and protect that damaged place that you cut your Are you really going to show the next picture? Oh, yeah. And then if you really need one... (laughs) If you need to make a mask for whatever reason. You Shut know, your mouth. You know, pandemic your mouth. catches you out in the middle of nowhere. And then the last one, you can also use it to beautify America. No, we're going we to beautify America. America. There you go. Let's see. Oh, boy, yeah. You can't see the last bar. Uh, no, that, that's you. <laughs> well, you still you got to beautify America some way or another. Very good, So this, this is some, that's some things you can use duct tape for. And, and I, to be honest with you, I've actually heard of people actually making a belt, a water pump belt in an emergency, wrap it up and pretty thick to where it will can't dry very yeah. fast, but you can make a water pump belt out of it. So you've got to have some duct tape. And well, I, if nothing else, you can always just duck it and go on. I carry duct tape in my trunk with rope and a shovel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, for those extra my passengers God. you want to get rid of. <laughs> Call in your comments to... Uh, one eight six one eight four three six five seven two. Eight six seven five three zero nine. No one eight four three six five seven two. Oh, that's the firing, firing order. Yeah.